everyone, let's make creme brulee. This is one of my favorite desserts because it is so silky. Also, the top is caramelized and I love caramel. And in French, it is creme brulee. Um, the ingredients are vanilla extract, brown sugar, white sugar, yolks, heavy whipping cream, and four ramekins that looks like these. And remember, if you were a child, don't do anything in the kitchen without adult supervision. Preheat the oven now at 325 Fahrenheit. Pour the heavy whipping cream in the saucepan. Warm it on low heat. Beat the white sugar, the yolks, and the vanilla extract until it has a foamy texture. See how foamy it is. Did you know that the heavy whipping cream is what gives the creme brulee the silky texture? We need to add the heavy whipping cream in now. Um, and I'm gonna have my sister here to help me. We need to be constantly uh, uh, stirring and we need to add the heavy whipping cream gradually. Now we need to pour it in the ramekins. Pour a bit of the mixture into a ramekin and then place it gently into a dish with water. I am I'm gonna show you only one because um, I don't want it too hard for me to carry. Bacon now for 30 minutes. See you in 30 minutes. The creme brulee is done baking, so let's take it out of the oven. We need to put it in the fridge for three hours. I just took my creme brulee from the fridge. Um, now we need to add a light sprinkle of brown sugar on top. Make sure that the sugar is dry or else it will not caramelize. Caramelize the sugar using a blowtorch. If you don't have a blowtorch at home, you need to use the oven broiler for one minute. Let's eat this beautiful creme brulee. Oh, I like that sound. It is very delicious. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, and hit the notification bell to never miss another video. If you enjoyed this video, watch this video or that video. They're both awesome.